Go for it. Not your first rodeo. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, James and Mark here with another mukbang. Today we are celebrating something special. It is our three year anniversary on YouTube. Woo! High five. Today we are doing something called Bude Chige, yeah. which is army based stew, uh -huh. which we've done on our channel once. Like two years ago, it's one been year a, ago, I don't know, it's been a while. It's been a hot minute, but we decided to upgrade. Level up, level up, and we added uh, some king crab leg to it. So it's going to be delicious, guys. So there's, there's some broth in there, tofu, spam. We had a sausage, uh, ramen, cheese, and all these other goodies. I feel like it should be called like hodgepodge stew because you no, just add everything in really, there. Yeah, it is. Also have a special drink that we're going to be doing to celebrate today. Uh, Mark likes the name of this drink because it sounds like his name. Makoli, yeah. Markoli. So this is the peach flavored one. Mm. And what is makoli for anyone that hasn't it's had it? It's a traditional rice wine. So mm. it looks like milk. Yeah. But it's actually rice wine. And it's slightly carbonated naturally. Oh. But then, so that's why you can't shake it violently. You just oh. have to yeah. slowly shake it. Because what happens if you shake it too much? What happens? Uh, you become like James after is, dark. <laughs> <laughs> Drinking them out of these like traditional brass bowls. Oh, this is brass. I was gonna say gold. So or thank tin. you for sparing me the embarrassment. But yeah. Oh, it's super cold, guys. Which is perfect because it is so hot right now in California. Uh, we had to keep the air on because we're like hot stew. That's not gonna be cute. We're gonna be sweating. Why in the are we time. eating this today? I know. Right. All okay, right. Cheers. cheers. So we just. Mm. All right. So how do we conquer this business here? I don't know. So we have the we have four king crab legs, which we got at Costco. Yeah. Twenty five bucks a pound. This is almost exactly three pounds. Yeah. So do the math. Seventy five dollars. Ooh, yeah. think Asian. <laughs> so yeah, just to are we putting it back in here? Uh, yeah, maybe put these smaller ones, and that'll flavor the soup, right? Yeah. So last night, we actually went to the market and got all the ingredients. Mm -hmm. No, thank you. So that way there was a little less running around this morning. We just had to pick up the crab today, really. So three years, doesn't it feel like time went by so fast? Uh, it doesn't feel like three years, for sure. Not at all. It feels like maybe one year? Yeah, I feel like we're like amateurs still. Maybe it's because we don't do this every day, so it doesn't feel like three years, huh? Yeah. <laughs> I, uh, I think I'll be good in this too. I'm Actually, saying. you're right here. I'll add, I'll make an offering. Mmm. <laughs> oh, it's good. It's wow, good. we haven't had king crab legs in, in forever. Months, and it's actually good. I yeah. miss here. this flavor. I will cut this piece for us to get started on, and then add, um, the knuckle meat back into the stew. I think that will make, like you said, it will make it tasty. Oh, it's good. Yeah? Yeah. Try, oh, it's good. The broth's really good. Oh, oh my oh, god. Oh, it's good, huh? Yeah, like, it's like sweet, salty. It, it has all of the flavors you want in like a... In a broth. Broth, yeah. oh my gosh. Oh, well, there's Spam in here. How do you keep it from like not being super salty. This spam? No, just in general, because there's a lot of ingredients here that could make it salty, but you got the soup like perfect. I don't know, you just do it. Oh, rice cake. Mm. Uh, one of my favorite part of Pude Chige. 
I like how you like cut it. Cut it. Make it fancy. It's super fancy. It is our. It is a three year anniversary. We gotta step it up. Mmm. Mm. It's good, huh? Ooh, I like how firm it is. We got some random bulgogi flavored so Vienna sausage. Mmm, ramen. Now, uh, for the ramen, did you add the seasoning that comes with it? I added like maybe half of it because I didn't want to make it too salty. Mmm. Well, guys, look. I have the, all this crab meat. Got my rice. I'm going to do this. What are you going to do? Just like spoon a little bit of the... Like that. Okay. You oh. know what? There is a Korean stew called Gotgetang crab stew. Uh -huh. It kind of tastes like this. Oh. Well, we made it unintentionally then. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Oh, more. So good. Mmm. 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 Right? Mm hmm Oh. How's the ramen? I'm making it sound good. It was really good. Mm. Mm. Ramen and rice. Carbs on carbs. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Like the ramen absorbed all of the flavor of the stew. Of all the Korean stews, this is like one of my top three, I would say. Yeah? I would, yeah. Just cause like, you know me, I love variety. And this is, this delivers on variety. There's some pork belly right here. Now, honestly speaking, three years ago, did you think we would keep this channel as long as we have? <laughs> Let's be, like real talk. Uh, real talk. I didn't think I was going to be on it for that long. I thought I was just going to do guest appearances here and there, but now it's like every mukbang almost. You're like, okay, so this is this is how I describe you. What? Uh, Steve Urkel on Family Matters. Yeah. He was supposed to just be a guest star, but then people responded so well to him that he became a permanent cast member. That's you. People took a huge liking to you once you had your first on-screen appearance. So should I say thank you or screw you? Just kidding. <laughs> you just say, did I do that? That's what you should say. Did I do that? <laughs> Let's get some more uh, makkali action going here. Cheers. So yeah, as the soup gets absorbed, you could always add more of your broth to the mix. Sure. Oh, I'm eating so messy, but I guess what's the difference today, right? It's, it's, we're s behind the scenes right here, it's so messy, but you know what? I'm, I have the makgeolli in me, we're so eating king crab, we're celebrating a little three anniversary. It's like, okay, we're I just, we'll just buy a new house. What? Oh. <laughs> I guess if you guys are interested, there was a lot of, um, people interested in the grill pan mm. that we had. So if you guys are interested in this, we'll also link it down below in the description. If you guys want to get one of these, you can do, this is what we use for our hot pot. We made our oh, stews yeah. in here. Mm -hmm. So very versatile. Ooh, my has ramen all over it. Ooh. I think one of the pieces were like sitting on top of the cheese. So I feel like some of the shell might have cheese in it. Look, I, look at what I'm doing. <laughs> Oh. oh, I get all the meat out. Yeah, just eat it like that. That looks funny. Yeah, <laughs> just go for it. Not your first rodeo. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, yes, it's hot. Mmm. <laughs> I'm usually a purist, so like with king crab, I'm just like, you can just eat it plain with butter. This is like, 
I can do this. It tastes so good with the broth. Mm. We only planned to do this last night. We didn't know what we're gonna eat, cook. James wanted to do. Can we share some of our, so we, we do brainstorm sessions before we actually like plan out our videos and we threw out a couple of different ideas. Here Here's the ideas that did not make the cut, so. Well, so James, since it's a three year anniversary. Yeah. He wanted to do 30 orders of McDonald's french fries. That'd be cool, no? Sure. Mm. Do you not remember the chicken nugget challenge that we did? Mark wanted to do, um, what's the name of that champagne? Dom Perignon. Dom Perignon champagne with, was it with King Cab or yeah, macarons? Yeah, or just anything. Yeah. I was like, I will hey. Well, this was uh, on sale for four ninety nine or six ninety, <laughs> whatever it was. It tastes just as good, huh? Yeah. You might have to go back to Costco and get more crap tomorrow. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh, it's delicious. It's nice eating this at home. I think I said this in our last video, but when you go out with your friends and eat this, you're always competing for the spam. Here, it's just me and you. So. Like I said, I knew Mark was the one for me when I realized, okay, I can share food with this guy. Why? I was not a food sharer to begin with. Oh yeah. So it, it, it definitely helps that I share food now. I think you're only okay with it because I'm not as greedy with food. So if there's any good piece, I'm like, well, you could have it. So for you, you don't get to lose out on anything. So you're like, oh, I could share food with Mark. Did you just call me greedy in our three year anniversary video? That's not... I didn't... I said I'm not greedy. Doesn't that imply that I'm no, greedy? No, I didn't say it. <laughs> we play. So, in three more years, where would you like to see us be with this channel? Mm. Just to continue what we're doing, because it's such a fun hobby for us, too. Yeah. Something for us to do and plan for. It's like a... I would say it's like a half-day affair between, like, prep, Sitting down, talking about like what we should do, mm -hmm. editing, the eating part, the best part, I think is the eating part, right? Yeah. Mmm. Mmm, that looks so good. Oh my oh. god, yeah. Oh god, careful. Oh. 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 My. Oh my god. That, ramen that's... wrapped king crab leg. This is gonna be epic. Oh girl. Oh my god. That looks so good, what you ever, whatever you just did. Mm. I'm gonna copy you. A little ramen, and then you wrap. I'm gonna just use this crab piece that you left behind. <laughs> mm. Mm. That was the best bite. Yeah. That was. Mm. So, I'm upset. <laughs> so, we, look. Ooh. It's like, that was fun. Here, I'll give you half. Mm, I don't want it. A third. I a lot of crap. I'll give you a third. Because I don't want to be greedy. Ah. This is all for show. James is only doing this because the camera is on. Actually, James has learned to um, really share some of his favorite parts of the meal with me. Mm -hmm. You're like, hey, here, have this. That's a recent change of James. You used to never do that. Really? Yeah. Mm. Well, I'm glad I've adapted. Found ways for you to, reasons for you to continue to love me. But if I had to guess, I felt like you ate more noodles than me. <laughs> just saying, because like I keep picking and it's just like this is all that's left. Mmm, <laughs> look guys, yes. Mmm. Oh. 
<laughs> I'm full. You look full. You wore a white shirt today. That's so dangerous. Oh, suck it in. No, I was saying more like because uh, the splashing. <coughs> but you didn't get anything on yourself. No, very impressive. I'm, I'm a clean eater. Yeah. Um, how about our word of the day for the video? If you guys got to this part. Three. Oh. You're getting less and less creative with these. What? Well, because naturally people will say three in the video without even getting to this part, if you make sense. Time out. Rewind. Oh, so like what uh, word of the day should we do today? Three. I hate when you waste my time. You're wasting my time. No, you're wasting my time. In actuality, then... we didn't waste time because we rewinded, so we went back in time. So no time was wasted. No, but now I have to edit all this. You don't, you don't understand. But how about wasted? No, just keep it with three. Okay. We have a PO box. So if you guys want to send us any like messages, notes, anything, check down below in our description. Thumbs up this video. Comment. Subscribe. Ring that bell if you haven't. And hopefully we'll be here for the next three years. So yeah, happy anniversary to all of us. Time for Botox. <laughs> all right, bye.